Hello viewers, welcome to my research channel. In this video, we will be discussing about the introducing to the Py research library. You can check it out or go to the Google and search it Py research. So you can see the interface of the library and the visibility. We are going to the first action, mass, face mesh. So and example of the face mesh after you go to see the uh, frame, thames and slack image and uh, you can see the hand tracking also and uh, you uh, last not least uh, we are updating day by day our library soon so you can see the post section so just you uh, uh, run your command first one command and uh, pip install py research then you go to the use these algorithm so let's start how to working uh, we are going to the our first of all ubuntu machine you can focus on the ubuntu and window so you can see the ubuntu terminal and uh, we are going to the firefox browser and search by research library uh, you can see the i am searching by research library uh, so you see the YouTube channel and the LinkedIn page just uh, two commands so I am copy and uh, paste it again by research tab. so you can check it out uh, one is the folder second one is library so you can check it out the library just uh, pip install uh, the com copy this command and go to your terminal window terminal and uh, unix main terminal so paste here so you can check it out that we are uh, we have two versions of the python one is the python 3.8 and 3.7 we are focusing on the 3.7 also okay you can check it out uh, we are going to the step by step uh, uh, running the algorithm and uh, our target is to achieve this library to users to our users our audience so you see you can see mm, python version and uh, python 3.7 version also uh, so it's easy to use uh, pyrisal library python 3.7 dash m install pyresearch okay so just copy and paste uh, and then you can we are going to the pseudo pseudo okay so you can check it out uh, its installation will be happen it's taking time it is too much small library so you just install first step you can install and uh, you after you use your algorithm um, step by step so you can check it out the uh, installation is done after installation uh, we are going to the download sublime okay so next step we are going to the check it out the uh, installation is done import by research okay uh, so it's done now we are going to the another step uh, you can check it out step by step any type of confusion you comment down and we are briefing again it it again so now so first of all we are downloading the sublime textbook we need it so for the uh, opening our example of algorithms so you can see the how to download and how to install uh, just download the ubuntu site and uh, if you use the window machine you can just download the exe formatter here you can see the some uh, modulatory commands will be used uh, it's uh, i think it's wrong okay so we are copy it again and paste uh, in terminal side so you can see the putting password get uh, authority for authority yeah, it's working now okay so after installation part done you can easily use to sublime for the algorithm it is best best for the 
uh, our textbook open source for the algorithm so you can add it easily and uh, using to is easily so we are going to the, uh, so again copy and press uh, in firefox side so you can check it out uh, how to uh, what how to uh, uh, copy and paste step by step so yeah we can it copy it again so Uh, yeah you can check it out the uh, copy now second command will be copy and paste here okay okay it's not working so we try to again from first command okay uh, this sublime link in description you get from sublime textbook from our youtube description site so you can check it out uh, one is copy second now second step you can focus on the video step by step we are running the algorithms and uh, step by step we are briefing the how to work okay so it's downloading then So uh, it, it will be happen on then your, your internet and your system depend on your system also uh, if you have uh, high RAM you can easily within seconds will be performed so it's taking time for our internet packets to download so it will be done within seconds so it will be done now it's processing to install okay it's done so you can check it out it installation will be done so now we are going to the uh, open the sublime textbook and uh, you can see the now step by step algorithm will be just copy and paste here okay uh, i am opening already uh, putting here some algorithm in my system you can check it out the uh, here there's some important libraries and uh, one uh, just loop uh, loop then uh, it will be happen on your front of you uh, you can see it's depend on you you put your video or you put here uh, zero means mention the camera okay in our scenario we will put here the one video file source okay you can check it out that we re-edit the name and put in the script side uh, we are mentioning the video for source in front of you and uh, you can check it out it's uh, on the home site you can see the running algorithm come on just python mention your python okay and uh, python 3.7 means we are all using to the python 3.7 okay so you can check it out the pillar the terminal again and uh, running the same video source file uh, you can check it out the fra fra how much fra frame per second will be working and that is will be working out the test section so if 97 percent will be accurate i will check i will check it out it again uh, first of all you can check it out the algorithm you can see the import the libraries mention the video source okay and uh, one while loop here they mention the image for per frame per second to convert into the uh, width and height of the faces into the frame and uh, detect so it will be happy now you can check it out 97 percent will be created will be working so you we are targeting another uh, example of the face mesh we are opening the first of all our supply to the uh, showing the algorithm first of all so you can see the how to open just for uh, searching the sublime uh, in we are open the sublime and uh, then we are uh, open the algorithm of the face mesh you can see the first algorithm uh, will be cleared in first detector 
now we are open the uh, face mesh algorithm you can check it out i am already put in my machine so face uh, mesh algorithm and uh, we have mentioned the source uh, our source of the video file so here we are uh, remove the zero and put here the video source you can check it out that uh, in previous video we are just copy and paste mp4 file so now we are going to run able to run this algorithm so just open the terminal uh, put here the script uh, python file ls means uh, we are i am showing you the all directories all files in my home page so pillar it and uh, run it again python 3.7 i forget uh, python 3.4 or 7 and you can see, see the fast mesh algorithm will be happen so uh, after running this algorithm uh, we are open the sublime and briefly some example of the code what will be called will be called uh, some discussion in code so you uh, here the input libraries here put the video for source and a loop uh, loop will be defined in the face mesh fit face rectangles angles and the uh, image per second uh, convert into the image per frame uh, into the video so here the last in least uh, releasing the our terminal so i will call it again uh, can check it out the result and accuracy it will be faster than uh, in other algorithms uh, so so guys you can see now we are going to the frame per second uh, so in this video also we are cal calibrate this frame per second you will be decrease the frame per second input library initialize the video and uh, loop and uh, mention you are uh, uh, attributes just like uh, x axis y axis and uh, run the algorithm you check it out the frame per seconds high frequency so mm, after this video we will going to uh, uh, just uh, releasing the second video so second uh, example uh, we are running a second algorithm now you can check it out the first of all demo of the second algorithm uh, second step so it's uh, going on the so you can check it out the image this tag uh, it's mentioned and uh, initialized to the images into the multiple frame now we are going to the hand tracking left hand right hand uh, easy and uh, you can check it out the how to visibility used uh, in the hand tracking side so Mm, I hope uh, we are going to the now going to the, want to going to the we run it again first of all just uh, python script name left hand right hand okay so it will be mentioned all uh, thing so okay uh, one hand will be detect at a time okay you can focus on the uh, this part uh, one uh, hand to detect in one time okay after uh, we are testing will be done so now we are going to the uh, mention the algorithm side so it's final version so you can check it out the both hand will be detect and easy to use so going to the sublime and uh, you you uh, i will check it out the script import the f file name uh, script names and uh, initialize the uh, all things and recommend out the uh, all uh, parameters uh, step by step line of the algorithm uh, now we are mentioning the uh, also uh, segregated one by one and uh, you can read it out and uh, you can check it out and uh, uh, run it uh, yourself so any type of confusion you do not uh, worry you just comment down we will uh, comment in our video source so you can also mention you can see the also uh, demo will be done 
so we are going to the now uh, last part post prediction so you can check it out one human is uh, uh, in mall site so will be post will be detected it's working on that 3d type x axis y axis is a bit tight okay uh, person will be detected and uh, pause will be also person was also will be detected so uh, it's machine learning algorithms high accurate high frequency high speed high frame per second will be uh, so it's library helping out you all these examples we are going to the also exploring the more uh, categories just like a yolo v8 okay so in this case in this scenario you, you can uh, you can check it out the our uh, currently examples video examples one by one and we are mentioning in our git account side by research side so after uh, you can see the demo will be done uh, now we are going to the script side they open the sublime uh, I think we are showing going to the sublime side now video will be post okay video will be done okay we are going to the sublime site you can check it out so you can see the script name is post dot by so just you copy from my py research site so you just paste here and uh, we are mentioning already one libraries loop and uh, releasing the uh, so you can check it out the window from release and uh, script name is python post dot py uh, is the running file name so you can check it out we are uh, all algorithm running with uh, python 3.7 it is not a dependency issue you can easily run through window and uh, linux main terminal so, okay so i hope you like it kindly support our library so use our library any type of confusion you comment down we help it out